Today, Streamlabs is rolling out Collab Cam. This new free feature lets streamers invite a guest to their live stream and recordings without leaving the Streamlabs desktop. Collab Cam works for YouTube, Twitch, Facebook, Trovo, and a custom RTMP. And I'm gonna show you everything you need to know about it. So by the end of this video, you're up and running. Here we go. What is up all you awesome streamers? Wild here helping you become bigger and better with everything Streamlabs. Now when it comes to Collab Cam, all you have to do is open up Collab Cam in your Streamlabs desktop software, generate a link, and send it to whoever you wish. Your guests simply have to click on the link and they'll be invited to join your stream. Now there are many different ways to use Collab Cam for your stream and recordings and I'm gonna give you a couple of ideas at the end of this video here, so stay tuned. But if you wanna get up and running right away, using Collab Cam is extremely easy. All you have to do is open up your Streamlabs desktop software as you normally would. Then click on the plugin sign next to sources and add a new source. Then you can choose Collab Cam and click add source. From here, double click on the Collab Cam from your Streamlabs sources list to bring up this pop-up window that you see on screen here. Then we can click on start Collab Cam and copy the link and send it to whoever your guests are, gonna be via a DM or an email. After your guests join the stream, you can double check their video to make sure everything looks good. When you're ready, click show on stream. Now, before I give you some awesome ideas on how to use Collab Cam, I wanna go over something important and give you some best practices. You, the streamer, are responsible for everything on your stream, including what comes out of your guest's mouth. So remember things like TOS and community guidelines. To give you some really good tips here, we recommend you only share your Collab Cam link with people that you know and trust. If you set up Collab Cam while you're already live, make sure you don't share your screen. If you suspect that your link has been linked or shared with anyone else, you can always generate a new link and this will invalidate the previous link. All right, let's get into some fun ideas on how you can use Collab Cam. You can go live with another streamer who is also live and have yourself a little stream inception. Show yourself or your setup from a variety of different angles by using your phone as an extra camera. You can use your phone to connect to your stream, so this way you're not chained to your computer. You can connect a pet cam to show off your most treasured companion. Host a guest from the Streamlabs mobile app on your phone. You can even create a community by co-hosting streams regularly. Share avatars with your friends on stream, which means all you VTubers can rejoice. These are just some fun and simple ways you can use Collab Cam to collaborate with other streamers or audience members. So give it a shot and let us know how you plan on using Collab Cam in the comments. Now, at the moment, you can use Collab Cam and host up to four guests on your channel. It does require using Streamlabs Prime. So if you need to know any more information, I'll put a link in the video description for you. If you need any more help with anything Streamlabs or any of our cool new features coming out, hey, make sure you hit like and subscribe to our channel. And I'm going to catch you in the next video where I make you bigger and better with, of course, everything Streamlabs. I'll catch you later. And as always, take care. And of course, peace.